the labelings but since this is in VR and it's an immersive medium you can even walk around the 3D model and uh, the labelings will rotate to face you. So that was the anatomical data, which is basically the, the, the understanding of how the part looks and its dissection. But students also try and understand the cardiac cycle through what is called the Wiggers diagram. This diagram is helpful to uh, see uh, the volume in milliliters and the pressure in the heart. And uh, they often struggle to correlate this two-dimensional data with the three-dimensional information that uh, is the animation. And um, here, having them side by side and giving the students the ability to pause the animation and the graph at uh, any time will really give them um, a way to appreciate the way the heart contracts and expands and the way it looks from all angles. These arrows um, represent the direction of blood flow through the heart. The blue is for the deoxygenated and the red is for the oxygenated blood. Um, these are synced with the contraction and expansion of uh, the valves. And uh, as the user can also crouch and see um, all of this detail and feel like they're even inside the heart.